In this video a small little fuel tank will be added to the engine of this car. This is the mechanical fuel pump and here on the left side this is the hose which sucks the fuel from the fuel tank and this hose on the right side this one returns the excess fuel into the fuel tank and the third hose uh, this one this one is sending the fuel the gasoline through the electric valve and the filter to the carburetor of the car this car has a electric valve because uh, it has an LPG system also and the fuel has to be shut off when the car is not working on gasoline okay and only those two hoses which are on the left and the right side only those two will be uh, changed I undoed the lower part of the hose I take all of these hoses off this hose was on this pipe which uh, returns the fuel to the reservoir that's the return line and this was here on the left side on this metallic hose pipe that sucked the fuel out from the original tank okay and here I'm testing the fuel pump and uh, I attached the hose and some water to the suction part of the pump and let's test it if it's drawing some water no it's not drawing any water the fan accidentally pulled the entire setup down okay so I tested the pump with uh, some saliva simply with my finger and some bubbles were detected here on the right side and some suction was felt on the left side of the pump so that means that the fuel will be eliminated here on the right side this will send the gasoline to the carburetor of the car okay and this is the bottle that I will use it's gasoline in it I made some holes onto the cap and connected the new longer hoses onto uh, that uh, cap I filled I screwed it in and let's test it let's start the engine the engine started on LPG and it's constantly revved to uh, generate some RPM and it I will switch it to gasoline now and the fuel level drops now it's on gasoline now it's an LPG gasoline again and afterwards the engine will start and work on gasoline so the LPG is used only to give an RPM to the car to the engine that will uh, activate the fuel pump and the excess fuel is being returned into the bottle and the rest of the fuel goes to the engine so the small little tank is working and it's constantly dripping inside the bottle uh, the bottle itself is sitting on the fuel line near that uh, black electric valve and here the two hoses are visible the metallic pipes and this one is the fuel filter which is full of dirt and rust from the old gasoline tank the fuel is dripping nicely so it's working the this small little tank is used because the car runs mostly on LPG so the old big rusty tank is not needed so this is a startup the fuel is instantly pumped as the key is turned in the ignition and let's make another test and simply taking the cap off and we can see that the fuel is being pumped and returned into the bottle so that means that the bottle does not mean to be airtight the pump simply sucks out the gasoline on the left hose and returns the excess liquid into the bottle on the hose on the right and this is working fine for now now the car is on 
LPG, it's on the right side. There's the fuel selector switch, and we can see that the gasoline is pouring down, and that means that's it from the other side. That means that the gasoline is constantly being recirculated and uh, pumped in this uh, reservoir even if the car is not running on gasoline and that's causing some fuel problems because uh, it will eliminate through uh, vapors and this is the fuel pump and we can see that gasoline is on the side of the pump and that's not good so I decided to add a small little hole between these two hoses and that little hole was made with a needle and that will eliminate the excess pressure from the bottle and let's clean it down clean the fuel pump and let's check it now after the hole was created and now it's okay there is no fuel on the side it was pressurized and uh, pressure pressed the liquid down here into the fuel pump okay let's start the engine again and test it this way also it's dripping nicely it's working there's the hole on the cap and let's see the pump it's pretty dry Gas gasoline is not leaking and that means it's working fine that screw was uh, tightened here on the top also okay let's play a little bit with the engine it's working nicely and it has a hard shape with those two hoses on the side the engine is consuming quite a lot of gasoline because the carburetor is not set up correctly so the bottle is close to empty in just a few minutes of testing okay it's working fine let's see from the other side the heart shape is visible and the gasoline is being pumped and that's it for this entire setup thanks for watching and bye bye